Entrepreneurial Leadership, Five Guys Burgers and Fries Introduction Five Guys Burgers and Fries Restaurant, since its launch in 1986, commands a large customer base. The restaurants use a philosophy of dealing in a few products but ensuring the highest quality in their products and services. At present, Five Guys does not intend to increase the products on its menu. Even though they can provide other products like milkshakes, they believe that other restaurants can do that more than they can. The restaurants specialize in selling specific items that they believe in giving high quality. Further, they do not sell frozen foods thus customers eat fresh foods. Notably, the specialization aspect ensures that employees work in their expertise fields, and through frequent use of skills in their fields, they continue improving quality. They do not sell products just to remain in business but aim at customers' satisfaction. Main Body Additionally, the restaurant has a designed menu that caters to any customer. For instance, for a hungry customer, they serve a full-sized burger with cheese. The customer's freedom of choice also facilitated the quick growth of the Five Guys restaurant. In contrast, other fast food chains are not specialists, they sell a variety of products ranging from roast beef, tea, and potato chips. These fast food chains prepare large quantities of food thus forcing them to use preservatives and, as a result, sell frozen foods. Lastly, these chains supply foods in fixed quantities, the customers do not have the freedom of choosing a different quantity. From this perspective, the flexibility that exists in the Five Guys acts as a distinct feature among the fast food chains. At the start of this company, some of the values were in place to ensure the success of the business. The values touched on customers, employees, products, management, and quality control. To begin with, the restaurant viewed the customer as the best salesperson, therefore, they had to treat the customers perfectly. Their aim was that the customers would go and talk positively to others about their services, in the process helping advertise their products. In that effect, they were spending too much on food at the expense of decorations. The next value is the crew's incentives. The employees are rewarded weekly for better outputs. These incentives improve productivity in a company as a result leading to fast expansion in their services. In the beginning, coffee was the product they were dealing in but they had to be humble in the food industry before settling on fries and hamburgers. The restaurants also empower the employees to feel business ownership, this value promotes equality among the workers. Finally, they did not relent on quality, cleanliness, and fresh food provision. Likewise, these values remain relevant in the food industry hence placing the food chain above others. The Five Guys Food Chain within a short period, realized the success that most companies took centuries to notice. They designed a website that enabled them to reach all the customers, this was due to the expansion in their services. Although they were selling food at high prices, they never missed customers, the customers had developed loyalty like a cult. Quality products and service deliverance is another reason for this drastic change. In maintaining quality, the brothers not only took the initiative in frequently visiting the restaurants but also sent secret shoppers to various locations twice a week to gather pieces of information for business growth. The managers led by example in giving direction for the business and thus inspiring workers. Besides, joining a market that was already dominated by other similar players shows that Mole's family was a great risk-taker and exploiter of opportunities. Risking in business is indispensable if one is to remain in the field for a long time. This attribute is an essential characteristic of an entrepreneurial leader. The third attribute is the empowerment and enticement of employees. It is notable that the employees' views are put into consideration during decision-making at the food chain store. This creates a sense of ownership and belonging in the restaurant, resulting in trustworthiness and accountability in the management affairs. Again, the company rewards employees for loyalty and work productivity, this act enables workers to increase their input in the firm with the aim of being motivated. The company's recognition of the customers also contributed to the quick development. The external markets streamline the cost of raw materials and therefore increasing the production cost. As such, the prices of fast foods had to go up and even lower the incentive ratio. Conclusion 
social and ethical practices are fundamental pillars of society. They look into the values and way of life among the public and involve doing a just act to others in the society. The Five Guys food chains incorporate these pillars into their culture. For instance, customer service delivery entails respect and care for others. In conclusion, entrepreneurial leadership is essential for the success of any business enterprise. This is evident from this case study has proved the need for characteristics like creativity, taking a risk, responsibility, and risks.